You are watching the Gopher and Tuck Show. This is the intro and later is the outro. We need a sponsor. Please sponsor us. Mentos Variety. I would need power and we're pros. Tucker needs him a new remote. Jumping for joy like an emote. Suck to our channel, no remote. Gopher fell off the edge. Here we go. Ah, we're back on the Forest Lands. I gotta tell Uncle Duncan about the thingy with the grove. But only Uncle Duncan. No one else. Not even Martin Montgomery or, or Joe Henk as a pig. Pig, I'm not gonna tell you about it, pig. You, you're not, you're not Duncan. Unless it got turned into a pig. Oh, okay, we're moving. Oh, they got Ryan Weatherall working this piece. Keenan Patterson. Hi, pig. Alright, see you, pig. Oh, 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 there's blood. That is blood. That is blood in the ground. Hello, oh. blood. Don't touch the blood. It's blood. You know it's blood. What? Yeah, it's fresh. Cool. You get you get to just look at it, man. You don't gotta. Oh, hi, dead pig. That your blood over there, pig? Someone, someone, do the old uh, stabby of the pig boy. Oh, there appears to be a fire of some sorts. Well, that's not good. Probably, presumably, anything over here. Anything in this wagon? No, nothing to interact with in, in... Okay, I guess I'm going this way. Uh, here's a cart, though. I can look at that. It's all tipped over and, and not in a good position because they're not supposed to be tipped over like that. Allegedly. So what do we got in here? Father's car. Oh, damn. Not, not Papa. Ahem. <clears throat> Maybe he got into a drunk driving accident. Oh, give us fucking titles for this. Oh. Winter may be coming, but at least still have his bacon. Oh, no, not his bacon. The pig! I mean, a cab, but like not those kind of pigs. Don't look at me. Look don't don't on, look boy. at me. There's nothing for you here. Father, I said move on. Uh, Unless yeah, you're sword. a bit of fucking pigs. I, you're killing the pigs. How are you gonna feed me the pigs if they're dead? Is that so? Yeah, yeah bro. You can try if you like, and then we'll feed you to the pigs. Get. You're not feeding me. My land. This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden of the north. Yeah, well, he's gonna be killed by I his son, so like shut up. Proper lordly sword like that. Spoilers. Oops. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, Dad. You be alright. Some robotessin. I'll have that sword, boy. No, you won't. This is not yours. It's not mine either. But you know. I. You'll have it. Oh, I told him he'll have it. What up, fuck boy? Out. Okay, that didn't work out too well. Try it again. Oh yeah, I am. I am getting my ass beat. And this guy wanted to be a fighter. He wanted to be a soldier. Pathetic. Oh, we have that action. Where that? Oh, yeah. oh. What up? Uh, uh, oh. Yeah, got him. Yeah, get fucked, bruv. Remember when you were alive? I remember. Wild times back then. Alright, what do you want now, Mr. Mr. Guy? Oh, 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 you coming at me now? Oh, spear! Shoulder block. Give me that sword. Give me that sword. Get that action. Don't do it. Oh, my leg. That's close to my penis. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 I say. Oh, X. X gonna give it to you. Yeah, my, my, my leg is not uh, feeling oh, fantastic right now. Hi. Please. I beg of you. I have a family. They'll never survive without me. I have no quarrel with you. I, I was only following orders. Mm, mm, ah, fuck it. He'll probably come back to get me later. Thank I don't you. really remember. I don't know if I did that or not in, in my initial playthrough of the, just this one chapter. See you hang for this. That much I promise. Okay, I I said to to let the other guy go. I didn't say to let that guy go. I don't want that guy to let go, though. So. But the other guy, you know. Um, he did. Father? Garrett, you survived. Did you not just see everything that happened? 
right in front of you? Your, your sister. Oh, she hid. In hell. I tried to stop them. <clears throat> Oh, and he's dead. Okay, well, that was that was quick. Good note. Good note. Glad you can stay alive long enough to let me know that. I'll kill the man who did this. You just let them go. You literally just let them go. You can't, you can't be like, I'll kill them, and you literally just told them they could just mosey on out of there. Ironrath, stronghold of House Forester. Limping my way on over there with my injured leg. Not getting immediate medical attention. A medical attention? Medical attention? It's Garrett! Yep, you know Get it. The Castellan. Tell him his nephew survived! <clears throat> nephew? So I'm about to talk to Uncle Duncan, who was the only person I should be giving this information that I have to? I'm down. Garrett! You, Duncan? I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the maester. Meet us in the Great Hall. Quickly. Ah, we're heading to the Great Hall. And it's gonna be quickly. Two White Hill soldiers? And a Bolton. And a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? Murder? My Murder sister, reasons? She, she was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. It's your family, too. Past the maester, never mind. But, you know. Seems young to be a maester. Mm, the blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. But the White Hills won't see it that way. I mean, I let several of them go. They got what they deserved. They did indeed. We can't let the White Hills just walk So are we just going to ignore the fact that I let some of them go? These I killed one of them. To help prevent infection. In self-defense. Hold the wound open for me, would you? I don't want to do that. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't want to do this. This is gross. Oh, yep, yeah, that's, I don't like that. Oh, oh, I don't like that. Oh, that's, yeah, I don't, mm. Ah uh, no. These are dark days, I fear. Not a fan of to that. The Lord of the House and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. <sighs> Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Our house <clears throat> will never fall. Never. By the gods, let's hope you're right. Except for when it probably will. This house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Although he is young, Ethan Hawk. and altogether oh, he's not young. prepared to lead. Right. Uh, I think I remember what happens uh, with with Mister Ethan um, in, in, in this episode. Uh, if he's if he's the character I'm I'm thinking of, I understand um, from your yeah, uncle that Lord you know, so Perfectly good life. times coming his way. Rather odd though that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son Roderick. I mean, Father Roderick couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of war. You are a maester and not I Uncle Duncan, so I can't tell you the thing. There was nothing we could do. Mm. Well, I'd imagine Lord Forrester would sacrifice himself to save anyone from his house, high or low. Lady I mean, Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first. Can't tell her. She's not my uncle. Wait on that leg. Yeah, I got maggots in this piece. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. I'll circulate my foot up your ass. Alright. Hey, the Lord's chair. Very, very, very normal chair here. Not not very iron throne -y, but you know, it, it's a chair. It looks chair-esque. You know? The old back situation there. You'd be nice and tall on that thing. Oh, oh, window. I have a window to look at. Presumably, you would be looking outside of the window, not at the window itself, but you know. Yeah, that, that's what that is. Didn't, didn't, didn't the message something about the Grove? Bro, going to Grove Street? 
Got know what I'm telling Uncle Duncan? Tell him about them them CJs and them, and them big smokes. Tell him that big smoke was the was the one who did the the murder of the mom or whatever. And then then Ryder was involved and it was that yeah. one car still in King's Landing, I suppose. The whole Although, thing going on in, I in there. Bring her home. Uh, let's check out Asher Roth Asher. over here. Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Damn, get fucked, Asher. Uh, hey, Roderick. Roderick. He was our best warrior by far. I mean, if he was the best warrior, then, you know, maybe he wouldn't have died. It was an honor to squire for him. All right, be in peace. Gregor the Good. But, did you just the same as Gregor? Right. Well, I guess his last name would be Gregor. Right, Gregor. The fourth born okay. Son. I mean, oh, just hold. She's always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a forester myself. And then this one. Talia and Ethan. Hey, it's Ethan. Lord Ethan now. Okay, cool. I learned more about them. Oh, I can learn more about them on the Codex page. Hmm. You seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Mr. Tengren. Look, fine. Uh, I'll show you. Just a little limp doesn't mean I'm fucking out here losing my dang leg. Why, why you gotta be saying words like that, sir? Anything? Anything else in here for me to, to me to interact with before I talk to old guy over there? No, okay. Well, let me check this uh, medical supplies first. Medical supplies, aka fucking maggots and what have you. You all got some healing herbs in this piece? Can I just, can I just have these? This might help. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna pocket that shit, I guess. Cool. Uh, <clears throat> take these bandages. That seems helpful. Seems very stiff. The way those they they were looking there. Uh, got the bucket of maggots. I right, let's touch the bucket of maggots. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? Don't, okay. just, don't just poke the maggots. That's, that's weird. That's a weird thing to do. Granted, I told him to do it, but you know. Uh, I might as well look at it. Yeah, yeah. Some of those are inside you now. Isn't that something? Uh, talk to. Did I don't know if I'm allowed to. Like, I think I'm allowed no. to show them the sword, just not tell them about the groove. I just wanted to ask you. Uh, what Why do the White this? Hills hate the foresters? I think it's safe to say the feeling is mutual. There's been enmity between the two houses for as long as anyone can remember. I don't doubt someone killed someone, which led to more killings of someone's, and then, well, here we are. Now someone's getting killed. Uh... The White Hills want Forester Ironwood. Ah, they'd take it all if we'd let them. Especially now with the Boltons in power. And proceed to clear-cut every last inch of it until there's nothing left. Just as they've done before. Sound like real fuckers. <clears throat> Who is the new lord of House Forrester? Why, you already Ethan, talked about Ethan. Of course. You already talked about it. You should just be asking about it rather than, like, who is it? Because you already know. At the you Citadel, fucking numpty. I swore an oath to serve whichever noble house I was assigned. <clears throat> yeah, fucker. Lord Forrester was an honor. Advising Ethan, his third-born son, is challenging. There's still so much he has to learn. Yet the very fate and future of this house rests in his hands. Which It'd is really like frightening when you think about it. I mean, uh, what will, what will me? happen to me now? Excellent question. Hmm. Under normal circumstances, you could join Sir Roiland and his men. Although, given the circumstances of your circumstances, it becomes. Say circumstances one more time. I suppose it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. Lord Forrester promoted me. At the Twins, I, I'm no longer a squire, if that matters. It might, I suppose. But I'll defer to Lord Ethan on this. Mm, you know, can I see him? See Ethan. Is he here? He is, but I'm afraid he's indisposed at the moment. He ah, Jango. disturbed while practicing his loot. Yes, his quote-unquote loot. You know, he can gets, I go now? You know, all right. I believe your leg will be fine. <clears throat> Don't mind jagging off. Welcome home, Garrod. Hi. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Hi, smaller lady. I heard what happened. Is it true? Your family. It'd be like that. Not gonna answer. I'm so sorry. NATO. 
So, can I see, uh, can I see my uncle? I gotta, I gotta tell him, that, dude, did you not see the light outside, dude? Hey, ain't bedtime. Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Whatever you can recall. He loved his family, my lady. He was very proud of Roderick. It seemed like the right uh, thing that says. Okay, him. well, I guess not. Fuck me. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He... He fought valiantly, my lady. Of course he did. He was House Forrester's best. I mean... Especially the children. But I was told. I yeah. was told you were the last to see my husband alive. You know yes, it. My lady. Yeah. I know it may be difficult to remember, mm. but <clears throat> when they ask, was there anything he said? You are not past my uncle. If you can remember. It I can give you this. So much to the family. He asked me to return this to House Forrester. There you go. You you have so that. This is where it belongs. With his family. Thank you, Garrett. Of yep. course. Yep. Now can I find yeah, Duncan? A response. It's too dangerous, especially now. now yeah, Duncan? I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. You, you do that. Duncan, this was our land. Oh, yep, here we go. Were our people. Your hey, Duncan. Family. This looks like I an older version of the Mister. I do, but now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. He's a bastard. That's why his name's Snow. understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. Ramsay Snow is coming here. Aye. He'll arrive within the week. Those men will say they were keeping the peace in the name of House Bolton. And what would you have us do? Snuffing. So I probably should have killed both of them. While they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett has lost as much as anyone else within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett's so I do have to talk to him. Already. You asked too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. My uncle's right. We need to be smart. Smart. Edward Stark. As, as Eminem once what said. Or no, as Dr. Dre once said. Be so smart. Don't be a... I can't continue that sentence. Ultimately, but the point is, be smart. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house, and he needs our help. It's lord of the house? The Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this is <coughs> you of murder. Can I clear my throat? What happened? You. The boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. I'd have done the same. I'll stay quieter. Any man would. I don't like any of the options. It's just the excuse Ramsey Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take, which is why you cannot stay. You cannot stay, Duncan. The boy has well, suffered enough. Where well, do I go? Where would I go? The one place beyond the reach of even House Bolton. Going to the wall. You're sending him to the wall. Yep, the that's, that's right. Done nothing wrong. Not in the eyes of the Boltons. I'm afraid it's the only solution, especially now. I the do what I'm told. So vulnerable. I'll do what's best for the house. So I'll go. I'm not afraid. I know it doesn't seem fair, but it is what's best. You'll remember my bravery. That's good, right? Probably. That settles it. Your mama settles it. You can have my horse, and I'll see you have plenty of food. <clears throat> Good note. So about the grove. The White Hills will come looking for you. Yeah, but I have a thing to tell you right now. Okay, wait, sir. Wait, sir. Sir. Oh my God, the guy. But dude, guy. Hey. Oh, he's gone. I want to. I, I gotta tell him a thing. Can I tell you a thing, Word sir? Up to me. I gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart. But I have an important thing I would. to mention. God's willing, someday I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider first. Can I say words? Lord Can I Forrester say words to you? Would be proud that you're putting the interests of the house ahead of your own. But words, though. Many of Lord Forrester's best men have volunteered for the war. 
His own great uncle was a this is not. These the are not. Watch. These are not the words I need to bring up right now. At the twins, we were to ride in the van to Casterly Rock, and and I at Roderick's side, but but then death happened. It was well deserved, Gareth. You worked hard and served your lord with honor. Yeah, cool. So about the thing. I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. Here we go. Am I? What? Uh, here we are. Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. Liam. He said, the North Grove can never be lost. What the fuck does that mean? I fulfilled Sorry. my duty. You caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. He said, tell only you. And I did. For good reason. Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wildlings and fools. So there's something to do with the, uh, with, with the with the walkers and whatever. You kept your word. The whites, the white walkers. You haven't all told them? anyone else, have you? I have not. This is important, Garrett. I have told no one. I told no one. Well done, Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. I told not From a person. Forward, this will be our secret. But soon, I may need your help. I can't From the wall. More just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. I mean, North Grove? Maybe it's above the wall. Don't breathe a word North? of it to anyone at the wall. Become a ranger if you can. It will help. Oh, well. Nah, someone had something to do with the old ice zombie boys. I am from ice. Uh, I am from yep. Ice. That, that, that phrase. Remember. You represent House Forrester. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll, I'll serve with honor. honor. I have been honorable so far. I know you will. Let a man live because he yielded, you know? That was that was honorable. I'm going full honor path with this guy. That, that's that's what I'm that's what I'm aiming for here. Add him out. Head into the wall. Gotta go meet Jon Snow, Sorry, hopefully. Wait. What, bitch? What do you want? What is that? Okay, give me a necklace. I want a fucking necklace. Look at that necklace. Be safe. I will attempt. And we out. Let's go, horsey. Just mosey on out of here with my horse. It's a horse. It's a horse. Yeah. So there we go. And that was my story. It's not, not your best. The Kirby one was better. I, I, well, I mean, you didn't really give me much to work with, Jess. Fucking, what do you want from me? You're the improv? Love you, buddy. Love you too, pal. Yeah. Yeah. So I got this rash on my 